Dear friends, welcome back to Automate with Rakesh. In this video, I am going to tell about the strategy that one can follow to clear this exam. Now, this exam is absolutely new for all of us. But no worries, we will again prepare some strategy to clear this exam. The very first thing you have to do is start getting the documentation that has been available in the new exam FAQ. Simply type UiPath new exam FAQ. This is the document. This document link, I am also going to pass it in the description of the video. So pick it up and open this. Now, this document is of great help. It has got multiple details around your exam. So you must spend some time. I have also created few videos on my channel describing some of the important points around this document. I hope you had a chance to see them. Otherwise, you can very well go and check those videos on my channel. Now, the next thing we have to have a strategy. The very first thing I am going to target is our advanced professional exam. So, you know, there are two different, three different kind of exams being introduced. One is UIPA certified professional automation developer associate for the entry level professional. And then we also have something called AI professional, right? These are the three new certifications. Now I am going to target the automation developer professional at the moment. And then once this is done, probably I will try to create some contents around Automation Developer Associate and later on the AI Professional Certification. Now our complete focus will be on this Automation Developer Professional, which was the UIARD or the Advanced Certification. Okay. Now this is the new version of it. Now the very first thing you do is there is something called Qualifying Exam. There's a description document. This is very important. And the other one is a practice test. First thing to build a strategy, you need the topics that you that will come in the exam as described in the exam description document. Let us first open this document. OK, now scroll down this document and slightly enlarge this. Scroll down this document and here, you know, our exams will be on UAPA Studio 2022.10. First questions comes to our mind. How do I get 2022.10? Now I'm telling you, even I'm going to practice on 2023.4.5. I feel this, it would have been better to have 2022 for sure. But again, 2000 having 2023.4 or any other version of 2023 or in the future, maybe 2024 doesn't matter because in the community edition, if you're you, like on my computer that you see, this is a community edition. This is an enterprise license actually I have. But again, if you are using a community edition, you can still go with 2023 or 2024 or 2024, whatever is going to come in the future. At the moment, it is 2023. So install it and you will be able to still practice and get what is needed for the exam. That is what I believe. And I am going to practice even in the 2023.4.5. Okay, I'm not going to go with a downgrade version or anything. I'm going to show everything on this one. And this is, I feel this is good enough based on my previous exam, which, which I have given and cleared it. Okay, so one thing is clear now. Now the next thing, what are the different topics are we going to get? You can see these are the main topics. Advanced Data Manipulation 1, Debugging 2, Advanced UI Automation, Advanced Control Flow, RE framework orchestrator. One, two, three, four, five, six. So here there is something called exam topics. Okay, exam topics. Here I think there's all they are also missing something called RPA testing. You might also get questions around RPA testing. Uh, it is not listed here, but again they have described here in the all the topics. The very first thing you do, copy this entire thing. Okay, scroll down and copy the entire content to an Excel file. So how do you copy Just you know, once you select it, just copy this. And while you are pasting into an Excel file or a Google sheet, anything you like, I'm using a Google sheet here, but whatever you like, you can just value, paste as value. So it will come in an order. Then I have slightly organized them by putting the numbers to the topics. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. There are total seven topics. Now each of these topics has got subtopics. For example, advanced data manipulation, use link query, for lists and data tables, perform data. So like that, they have got multiple different subtopics. Now I have seen most of this RE framework and orchestrated topics. There are a few additions definitely, but most of them, which is the contents are already available on my channel, UiPath Advanced Certification. Anything that those are new, I'm going to create content on them. 
okay to cover those topics now the next thing is how do we prepare for all of this what is the strategy because my main goal was to show you the strategy now the first strategy is we getting all the topics onto a sheet because we have to prepare topic wise okay that is our main aim we have to prepare topic wise so first thing i am going to start with some of the new additions for example computer vision uh, virtual environment using remote runtime build ui automation using web driver rpa testing there are a lot of new entries have been made so i am going to first cover this new entries re framework and orchestrator i think pretty much if you are um, you know you have worked on re framework or you are experienced with the previous knowledge of re framework i think that should almost do the good job but again anything different anyways you will get a content around that first let us start with some of the topic now what i have done for each of this major topics i created a tab called advanced ui automation okay advanced ui automation and under this these are the sub topics so this is the strategy so i've got all these sub topics so i know what i am targeting now while my preparation started advanced ui automation in this the very first topic is ai computer vision features in projects okay this is the main topic i am going to create contents on each of the sub topics under the main topic same way we are going to create multiple tabs like there will be seven tabs advanced data manipulation debugging advanced ui like that there will be uh, advanced control flow like that there will be seven more tabs and each of this tab for each of the sub topics we have lot of contents links uh, important links important points we are going to start you know putting them here so it will be lot of interesting you are just not learning and try you know there will be lot huge experience while you do it on your own you created a sheet you started writing things that is what the experience which would help you to enjoy the exam and clear it happily right so the same thing we are going to do as we have done in the previous advance certification playlist we are going to see those documentation the important points we are going to note we are going to practice some of the things in uap studio you know with complete learning we will appear the exam all right guys so best of luck um we would do our best i will try my best so this is one of the strategy but again if you have some best strategy you are always advised to follow that you know whatever your mind says and what you think it's right for you you can always do it but again i feel this is one of the simplest way so if you agree with me you can do it i i also welcome any other new ways you would like to attack uh, and plan for your preparation for the exam you are welcome okay so let's get started stay tuned uh, in the ui path advanced certification playlist i'm going to upload videos as you know as much free time i have i would like to create those many videos um, during during the night time or in the morning early morning i will try to create those contents for you and i'll be keep publishing then and there once the contents are created because i know i don't have much time to do it for you know couple of months from here i would like to cover them Uh, as quickly as possible so I'll, i'm going to upload as the moment i have recording is done i'm going to upload so stay tuned and get benefited so let's meet in our next video guys till then take care